Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord, you're welcome to Thursday, the 16th day of September, 2021. Our topic today is a key to profitable service. The Bible says, and the king said unto Arauna, Nay, but I will surely buy it of thee at a price. Neither will I offer burnt offerings unto the Lord my God of that which doth cost me nothing. So David bought the threshing floor and the oxen for 30 pieces of silver. 2 Samuel chapter 24, verse 24. Thought for the day, a costless service is a profitless service. Cost or sacrifice is key to acceptable and profitable service in the kingdom of God. There are people who are not willing to serve God sacrificially. They are married to convenience and to ease. They are not willing to pay any price for the sake of God. Beloved, it's a temptation when people make you serve God without any cost. A costless service is a profitless, profitless service. It doesn't matter how many times you come to church or what you do in church. If your service to God does not cost you your treasures, your harvest is not in view. Exodus 10, 19 says, and Moses said, we will go with our young ones and with our old, with our sons, with our daughters, with our flock and with our herds will we go. For we must hold a feast unto the Lord and you must understand that whatever does not have your treasure cannot have your heart. Matthew chapter 6 verse 21 confirms this. For it says, for where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Your money will always go where your heart is. For example, whenever you see a man's heart leaves his wife and goes after a strange woman, his money also flows in that direction. His wife and children may be starving or at home, but he's servicing another woman who has captured his heart. Beloved, determine never to serve God without a cost. Overcome that temptation because a costless service is a profitless service. Remember this, that a costless service is a profitless service. I believe that the Lord will help you in the name of Jesus. What's our assignment today? Number one, go through today's message once again. And secondly, refuse to serve God without a cost. Make up your mind about it. Praise the Lord. Let's pray. Say after me, Lord, I ask that you deliver me from the temptation of serving you without a cost. Help me to serve you sacrificially, O oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I believe you prayed that and you meant it. But I want to pray for somebody, both your, your, your resources, your life, your being, everything isn't serving God. You are not born again or you were born again and you are no longer in standing with God. You want me to pray for you? Pray this afternoon. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. I know I'm a sinner. I need your help. Jesus, please come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins and make me a new person. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. The Lord bless you. I believe that God is set for your lifting and that you are moving forward with great grace in Jesus' name. And it's your birthday today. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Happy birthday. As your day, so shall your strength be. I pray that the Lord will cause his face to shine on you and be gracious unto you. In Jesus' name, God bless you. Have a wonderful day and peace. Thank you.